guys, welcome back to your favorite channel, Lala Kazan. In today's tutorial, we're gonna talk about those triceps that we don't like when they shake, the long head of the tricep. Also, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please do so and don't forget to ring the bell for notifications. Let's get going. First, we're gonna start with overhead tricep extension using one dumbbell for both arms. Make sure you grab a dumbbell with both arms evenly and perform a full fold of your arms behind your head. Try not to hit your head with a dumbbell. Keep your elbows in, exhale on top, full extension on top and squeeze your triceps. I use a 25 pound dumbbell in this video for 20 reps. Repeat this for at least three to four sets. Moving on to single arm dumbbell overhead tricep extension, grab one dumbbell with left arm, bend your elbow, full fold behind your head, don't hit your head with a dumbbell, exhale on top and squeeze your tricep on top. Make sure your elbow does not move. Repeat the same on the other side, inhale when you fold your arm and exhale on top, squeeze that tricep, don't hit your head with a dumbbell, be careful. Repeat this for three sets of at least 15 reps on each arm. I'm using 10 pound dumbbell. Now, the mistake would be with overhead tricep extension, if your range of motion is half, it could be because the weight is too heavy or you're not going all the way down and you're rushing through the movement. For the next set of exercises, you'll need one side of the cable, just a typical cable machine where you can attach the hooks on top of the cable or on the very bottom. First, we're going to start with cable rope overhead tricep extension. The rope is attached on the top of the cable machine. You got to slightly lean forward. You may put one foot in front of the other, or if you want to test your core strength, then put both feet on the same alignment. Keep your elbows in, make sure you fully fold your arms behind your head, and then extend. You may extend the rope to the side slightly on the very top as you extend your arms, exhale and squeeze your tricep. When you finish, rotate your body nice and slow and let go. Here you see the same exercise from a different angle. My elbows stay on the same spot. Don't move them. Don't use your body as a momentum to extend the rope. Exhale on the very top, squeeze your triceps. And when you finish with the movement, rotate your body and let go nice and slow. We're going to continue with tricep overhead extensions with the cable all the way to the bottom. This is a much harder range of motion because the leverage is higher, meaning the distance between the weight and the muscle that it's being worked on is longer than the distance from the top of the cable. Make sure you extend your arms fully, just like it's shown in the video. Keep your elbows in. Don't rotate them. You may spread the rope on top and exhale on top by squeezing your triceps as well. You may also repeat the same movement with different handles. In this video, I'm using a rope and a straight bar. The same form and technique, exhale on top, squeeze your tricep, and when you finish, rotate your body nice and slow. Another variation of cable overhead tricep extension is using single arm. As you can see, I'm using a rope as a single arm handle, full fold of my arm, and full extension squeeze your triceps on top and exhale grab the rope with both arms and rotate it to click it engage your core don't let the rope pull you that full stretch is what's gonna hit that long head of your tricep when you finish rotate nice and slow you may also change the angle of your tricep single arm overhead extension and do it cross your body nothing changes you just step in to the side to the cable doing the same technique full fold of your arm and then extend fully by squeezing your tricep and exhale on the very top Now watch the common mistakes with overhead tricep extension. You're using your body or shifting your arm, not full range of motion, using your body as a momentum, or the weight is too heavy and you're going too fast and not performing a full fold behind your head. Remember, technique is the key. 
Thank you so much for watching this tutorial video. Until the next time, have a great week ahead of you. Don't forget to like and comment. I love you all. Mwah.